तो हाय हमाद के दवाई वेलकम ऑन योर पीडिया थैंक यू सर ओके हमाद यू आर माय ओल्ड स्टूडेंट इन द सेंस दैट नो वी आर इन कांटेक्ट फॉर लास्ट कपल ऑफ मंथ्स इफ नॉट इयर्स एंड आई कंग्रेचुलेट यू फॉर योर सिलेक्शन इन प्रेस्टीजियस एचपीसीएल थैंक यू सर एंड हमाद इट हैज बीन वंडरफुल जर्नी विद यू आई मस्ट से बिकॉज़ आई रिमेंबर इंटरैक्टिंग विद यू मल्टीपल टाइम्स and uh, you are a very sincere student hamad and uh, i am very sure uh, today when i am going to interact with you to aapki taraf se jo information aayega that is going to be very very helpful for students uh, because uh, every student wants to you know get a, a career or something like yours and they want to get into these kind of organizations uh, so your journey i mean uh, i also uh, know that uh, there were couple of psus which you could not hit एंड देन यू कैप्ट ऑन प्रिपेयरिंग एंड इवेंचुअली गॉट इन टू एच पी सी एल तो जितना भी मैं आपसे बात करूंगा दैट इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी वेरी इंस्पिरेशनल फॉर द स्टूडेंट सो आई स्टार्ट दिस नो इंट्रेक्शन विद योर बैकग्राउंड हमाद प्लीज टेल ऑल ऑफ अस हेयर विच पार्ट ऑफ इंडिया यू आर एंड हाउ वॉज योर इनिशियल अकेडमिक जर्नी एंड आफ्टर योर कॉलेज फ्रॉम विच कॉलेज डिड यू ग्रेजुएट एंड आफ्टर योर कॉलेज हाउ वॉज योर जर्नी टिल यू गॉट सिलेक्टेड इन एच पी सी एल so my name is amit kidwai i belong to lucknow uttar pradesh uh, i did my schooling from here and uh, then i pursued my graduation from aligarh muslim university in 2021 and uh, since 2020 uh, there was covid so i was at home mm-hmm. so from 2020 till 2023 right now i have been preparing and staying at home okay. so uh, preparing specifically for gate and psc examinations so sir maine uh, gate ki taiyari to kari thi 2020 se Yeah, so 2020, 2021, I passed out. Mm-hmm. So 2022, me there was gate examination and also there was notification of HPCL. Mm-hmm. So gate examination, though, uh, could not uh, I could not get into top 500, mm-hmm. but uh, HPCL ki maine preparation kari thi achhe se. Mm-hmm. And I remember, sir, uh, I was uh, putting too much time into technical part, mm-hmm. and usme maine uh, like uh, after the cut off uh, was reduced, mm-hmm. I saw that uh, I I missed it by two marks. okay and uh, uh, i realized ki maine uh, technical portion ko itna importance diya but non tech ko itna equal importance nahi diya hmm hmm so uh, yeah there, there i realized my mistake and also uh, in the pursuit uh, through gate 2022 i gave a couple of interviews uh, mm-hmm. like uh, nati bombay mm-hmm. uh, iocl brc mm-hmm. and uh, uh, steel authority of india limited hmm so in these interview also there was weightage of gate marks which was 75 to 80% so mm-hmm. interviews went well uh, mm-hmm. so i gained this uh, confidence within me that i can introduce myself and i can speak mm-hmm. but uh, the gate weighted high hone ki wajah se mera usme bhi nahi hua mm-hmm. and uh, now came the hpcl 2022 examination mm-hmm. uh, i knew my mistakes i knew my uh, what i did in my past so maine pehle pura proper plan banaya structure planning kari ki non tech question mein kya kya matlab syllabus kya hai uska देन mm-hmm. uh, उसको मैंने सर uh, uh, जो प्रीवियस uh, uh, जो टॉपर्स लोग थे उनका वीडियोस देखा एंड देन आई रियलाइज कि यू हैव टू फॉलो अ स्ट्रेटजी स्पेसिफिक स्ट्रेटजी फॉर नॉन टेक क्वेश्चन इज वेल मतलब टेक्निकल तो मेरा हो ही रहा था गेट uh, के गेट के साथ साथ बट नॉन टेक में आई हैव टू पुट पुट लॉट ऑफ वर्क सो नॉन टेक क्वेश्चन आई यू आई टुक द हेल्प ऑफ वीडियोस YouTube वीडियोस लाइक एसएससी जेई प्रिपरेशन एंड बैक बीओ प्रिपरेशन Mm-hmm. so usme uh, i used to practice a lot because it was all about accuracy and time management in the examination mm-hmm. so usme i did well and uh, cut off was 120.9 and i got uh, 134 marks in the okay. examination okay so you are talking about this hpcl exam huh? yes sir so what was the cut off so it was 120.9 for general category ah and how much you got so 134.5 Hmm. So, so, uh, Ahmad, you said you wrote HPCL twice, huh? Written exam. Yes, sir. Okay. So, अभी मेरे ख़ासे HPCL has they have conducted only twice their exams, right? Yes, sir. Okay. And Ahmad, uh, you you uh, were going for various interviews and you were missing only by small, uh, you know, some marks you were missing. Yes, I have not done B A R C, N T Bombay. ये सारे आपने sale वगैरह का किया. And you are from very good college, uh, Aligarh Muslim University, and 
यू स्टार्टेड वेल इन टाइम सो कैसा लगता था मतलब आपको यू वर सो क्लोज येट सो फार अवे यू नो क्लोज भी थे और yes, भी थे, कैसा लगता था ये एंड हाउ कुड यू सस्टेन फॉर देन प्रोफेशन uh sir in order to sustain i had a similar uh, group of friends that were, were uh, like seniors and friends who were preparing with me so i had that kind of support and also there was family support as well because mm-hmm. staying at home there was a lot of pressure preparing for examinations after dropping out from college mm-hmm. uh and sir exam exam ki matlab interview aa gaya cut off aa gaya result aa gaya usme aap do teen number se reh jao so there is a lot of uh, disappointment sir mm-hmm. uh, and at the same time there is a lot of learning as well ki matlab uh, where did i miss specifically uh, in my preparation like interview mein maine 100% diya apna i did my preparations uh, with europedia uh, mm-hmm. i have been like uh, a student of europedia since niti bombay iocl as well and now in hpcl so i have been consistent in my interview preparation but uh, where i lacking where i was lacking was my uh, non tech question as i said mm-hmm. so usme i improved and uh, yeah it went well mm-hmm. okay so hamad you wrote how many times did you write gate exam sir uh, including this year it was three times hmm aapne teen baar likha to kya share kar sakte hain aap hamare sath aapka gate journey sir in 2021 it was uh, i had got uh, 1057 rank okay uh, uh, in 2022 it was uh, 642 rank okay and uh, in this year it, i got uh, 421 rank okay so uh, continuously improvement was there hamad right yes sir so, there was an improvement yes and another thing uh, as you said ke gate ka aapka acha rank nahi aaya tha iski wajah se aapka gate ke through jo psu the wo aapko nahi mil pa rahe the but then hpcl you could crack so do you think this is a good uh, strategy or this is a good opportunity for students that some psus are coming through gate and some psus are having their own exams so that if gate day is not your day at least you stand another chance so what is your take on that what is your view on that Yes, sir. I completely agree because uh, there is a certain amount of luck which is attached to any examination that you give, yes. and gate is a like very much uh, dependent upon that because on that day how do you perform? Uh, it totally depends upon the uh, you know lot of circumstances. Yes. So uh, I would say that it is a golden opportunity for students that they are getting another chance to prepare, mm-hmm. and uh, because they are also able to realize that what did they do wrong in gate. and they get sufficient time to prepare for these examinations because they come in the mid of the year whereas gate in is in the starting of the year mm. uh, like in feb and uh, these psus come in around uh, august and september so there there is sufficient time to prepare and uh, to uh, improvise and to uh, sir it is all about like self introspection ki uh, to realize your mistakes and work upon it so people get sufficient time and if you are able to if they are consistent enough and they are disciplined so it is very easy to get through these exam these examinations okay now now i will ask you uh, uh, related to hpcl uh, hamad you said that uh, first time you wrote hpcl you focus more on technical second time you realized your mistake because you missed by only some marks so you then focused overall and then you got a score in hpcl uh, so uh, hpcl is conducting exam for the last two years every year i mean simultaneously they are doing it hopefully they will conduct again so those students who want to write this hpcl exam hamad can you give them some guidelines for the written exam first i mean how they should prepare uh, since there are uh, people are already preparing for gate examination so they have their technical portion but uh, still there is a catch as well ki uh, gate mein uh, there is a lot of calculation based uh, questions and they are requiring deep uh, knowledge and uh, application of concepts but uh, in case of hpcl it is more like uh, the creamy layer questions like uh, if you see the question if you are not able to re- uh, if you are not having it in your memory you won't be able to do it so it requires a lot of practice and uh, specifically doing previous year questions i would say ki uh, doing esc and gate get one marks previous year questions helped me a lot uh, because in 2021 the hpc examination was uh, uh, quite easy as compared to this year okay it was only one lakh questions last year but this time they gave uh, straight uh, esc previous year questions so there was uh, like Uh, select uh, which were uh, right like uh, they were like statement based questions okay. which came straight from that uh, previous year esc questions mm-hmm. so i would say keep focus upon the previous year questions and also uh, having a clear strategy for uh, the non tech question will help a lot mm-hmm. so so if some student is already aware about gate exam and evening services exam so where you think written exam of the hpcl stand is it objective part of evening services and one marker of gate so how do you uh, define that 
Yes, sir. It is uh, like uh, more of theory based than the numerical. And if even even if numericals are there, it will be gate one marks questions. And otherwise, the theory part will be complete com coming straight from the JC previous questions. Mm. So, Hamad, any other exams other than HPCL which student can target other than gate if they want to land up in PSUs? Uh, yes, sir. It depends on which PSUs are conducting the examinations. Like mm. uh, last year, it was Oil India Limited and Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, which mm. came uh, along with uh, at, with the uh, HPCL. So, mm. I prepared for those examinations as well, uh, but. Uh, uh, there was a GK part also there, so I could not crack them. Mm -hmm. Missed by a certain marks. Okay. And Hamad, now coming to HPCL uh, into and group task. So, uh, HPCL uh, into and group task is very important in the sense that they have cut off for that. So, at, I think there is some minimum marks you have to score in group task also and in uh, interview also. Uh, otherwise, you cannot uh, go in the next round. And uh, what I remember is uh, both of these were very good. I mean, you were doing very good in these both uh, uh, group task and interview. I want you to share your own experience now with the students related to group task and interview. So I'd like to tell that uh, in the beginning of my preparation, I could not even uh, like, I was not even fluent in my introduction. So your PD helped me a lot. Uh, like uh, there were uh, a numerous number of uh, sessions that uh, we could have with you, your with the mentors. And that helped me a lot. And uh, uh, it was all about uh, developing a fluency and being prompt at the same time. Uh, because in GT, uh, there were uh, like etiquettes that were, that were being taught to us. Ki, uh, you have to have your composure. You don't have to raise your voice and you, do, you have to be calm and you have to be supportive. Uh, so it was all about that. And uh, like in my in my case, the GT group, uh, there were seven, seven members, seven members in which only uh, two of them were selected. One of them was me because it got uh, too violent. And uh, the discussion was going haphazard in haphazard manner, and there was no conclusion in the group. Hmm. Conclusion didn't even happen. So okay. it was all about uh, uh, being supportive and uh, giving other people the chance to speak rather than uh, jumping in between hmm. and uh, being very calm and uh, taking the team along with uh, the taking the team along. Hmm. And in PI, I would say key, uh, it was all about uh, the it was all from the detailed application form that okay. uh, was filled. And uh, also, it was all about the introduction part uh, that uh, mentors helped me. Uh, like uh, there were certain specific points uh, which in which we want to have questions from. So we used to put that points uh, straight into our introduction. So mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, uh, there were seven seven panel members. So I would say that it is a very rigorous process because each panel member is uh, continuously focusing upon each and every word you speak. So mm -hmm. they they might uh, end up. Uh, asking questions from uh, in the deep manner from your introduction only. So it was, uh, yeah, it was coming from introduction. Hmm. Okay, Hamad, can you tell us what was the task, group task? Because HPCL is uh, asking similar kind of task. So can you uh, share with us what was the task which was given to you? Uh, sir, uh, the last year tasks were getting repeated, but uh, there was a there was a catch here. Like my was help for all, but hmm. uh, there was a lot of unnecessary data which was given. Like it was a three page task given rather than the only one page task, which is health for all, health for all main part. Mm -hmm. But uh, there was some unnecessary information given to it in order to confuse the students. Like the main information was given on the third page okay. and the first two page were only uh, like uh, was the was one was not needed. So mm -hmm. there was like a random information given mix up. Mm -hmm. So you had to basically find out the main topic first in order to get through in the right direction. Okay. Yes, sir. Basically, uh, introduce yourself and, first. And before you tell that, I think this year, HPCL may intro was all about HR. Bohut kam yes, technical question puche gete, right? Yes, sir. It was not of technical. Mm -hmm. Technical part was coming from my project only, like what you did in your project. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, sir. what you did, that was all. And if mm -hmm. you are able to explain it in a fluent manner, they won't ask again. Okay. And uh, in HR part, uh, there was like, uh, why do you want to join HPCL? Mm -hmm. uh, like introduce yourself first. Mm -hmm. And then they'll ask uh, about uh, from introduction key, what are, what are your extracurricular activities? Mm -hmm. And uh, like, what do you do to release stress? And uh, like, uh, since my hobby was uh, fitness, so they asked me that, that uh, what is the influence or what, how it has helped you in your daily life? Mm -hmm. uh, how it helps you to, uh, you know, achieve your goals? Uh, yes, sir. It was all. Uh, it was all from this. All HR only they asked you, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. So, Hamad, now uh, uh, I think you are still not got your joining in HPCL, right? 
Yes, sir. Because, sir, uh, there were certain, there are for, uh, number of batches mm -hmm. uh, which, which is being created for training. There are 40 students in one batch. So, first batch is going on 8th April. Okay. Uh, the second batch will go on uh, like 15 days later. Okay. So There's an induction program which is going on in Pune. Uh, okay. It goes on for, for like 15 days. And uh, after that, next batch will come. So, everybody is going to go to Pune only, right? Yes, sir. Mm. They'll uh, reimburse the flight tickets, sir. Okay, wonderful. So, uh, needless to ask you how you are feeling. It must be wonderful, Hamad. Yes, sir. I'm feeling on top of the world. Okay. Wonderful, Hamad. So, uh, let me again uh, now thank you, Hamad, for the time you spared. And uh, I want to end this entire interview with the, your message to the students who are listening to you. Anything you want to tell them? Uh, so, don't give up and be persistent because you don't know uh, where, which examination will... Uh, you, which will hit, which will hit, and uh, which will you succeed? So just keep on uh, giving examinations, whichever you get, and uh, keep on preparing. Don't give up. So mm. wonderful, Hamad. And let me wish you all the very best in your career ahead, Hamad. You are you are a very sincere student, and I'm very sure you will do wonderful in your career. And this is a wonderful organization, HPCL, and you will do great. Thanks a lot, Hamad. All your blessings. Thank you. Thank you.